Well, back to school at the beginning of August. That's on the agenda at a unique school in Bridesburg. We have three eyewitness news at four. Mark, it may be summer, but youngsters who attend First Philadelphia Charter School are already back to school. Young tour guides converge on Philadelphia's Independence Seaport Museum. They're fifth grade students from the First Philadelphia Charter School. 25 fifth and sixth graders from First Philadelphia Charter School completed their dancing lessons today. And congrats in order for First Philadelphia Charter School Basketball Championship. The Brightsburg section of town, a great time out there with the kids of the First Philadelphia Charter School. This is NBC 10 News at 6. A dazzling display of cultural diversity today at the First Philadelphia Charter School. All right, John, some fourth graders learn what it takes to get fit. NBC 10 at the First Philadelphia Charter School in Frankfurt. Three published authors visited the First Philadelphia Charter School for Literacy yesterday. Young chess players matched wits today in the Bridesburg section of Philadelphia. The First Philadelphia Charter School for Literacy. Fifth grade students from the First Philadelphia Charter School sailed the Delaware River on the schooner North Wind. Veronica Licciardello read from the story Pooh Helps Out to the kindergarten first and second graders at First Philadelphia Charter School in Frankfurt. Three, two, one, light the tree! As long as I live and my foundation exists, and long after I'm gone probably, we will be working tirelessly and with as much effort as possible. Philadelphia's Charter School for Literacy Choir serenaded Sir Elton with his standard Philadelphia Freedom. I welcome you to our groundbreaking ceremony. We're going to break the ground and make the, um, the new school. I saw the picture of it in front of the school when it was in the, in the window. I think it would probably look really nice, and I'm looking forward to going next year. We'll put all kinds of things in it. Like what? Like the new, a new music room and a new science room. I've seen the pictures. I think it looks great. I can't wait to go there. Our original building was designed as an elementary school. It is most appropriate and necessary that today we begin construction of a facility specifically designed with a middle school in mind. <laughs> Our new building will house grades six through eight, include 10 middle school classrooms, two lecture halls, a science lab, and also technology for the future so that our students are ready for success in high school and college. Our new building will provide a state-of-the-art theater, which will seat 700 people and provide space for the school community to gather as a group. NBC 10 News at 5. Well, the Mummers were on hand for the grand opening of a new charter school building in Philadelphia today. The Philly Fanatic also got into the act, and the first Philadelphia Charter School for Literacy dedicated its new building in Bridesburg. <laughs> not going to be crowded anymore and also it's real big and every every floor they have windows so you can see the city you can see outside you can see everywhere and it has a great view and the classrooms is also very nice it's new improved and like besides the, um, the old school but we have like everything improved there. it's nice to say that I'll go to first Philly. I, I like the auditorium because you get to do a lot of plays there, and it can, and a lot of people could be seated in that um, auditorium to watch, um, to watch our graduation this year. When I walked into the auditorium, I was just like, wow. I think it was pretty amazing because we never really had any a big auditorium like this that could fit so many people. Well, we have an orchestra pit on the bottom, and we have a great sound system. <laughs> What I like about First Philadelphia Charter School is like you have a lot of opportunities to do. Like um, I've been in dance, and uh, we do a lot of dances, so a lot of kids like get grouped in with everybody else. We did ballet, jazz, and ballroom. It was like all grouped up together. Everybody had so much fun. Was on TV. Our school is a Go Green type of school. We have a recycling committee. 
and a group called the Earth Corps and we actually got a greenhouse. This school is not just all about learning. You could learn and have fun at the same time. This is a good school, a nice environment, nice kids, the principal, she, she's perfect. She knows every, every student in, her, in the school, she knows their name by heart.